There are three types of places for storing and carrying out activities which involve harmful substances such as the laminar flow cabinet, the film chamber and the biological safety cabinet. The laminar flow cabinet is used to prevent the store objects from being contaminated by air contaminants. In the laminar flow cabinet, air is sucked into the cabinet and then filtered by a HEPA filter, which eliminates the contaminants in the air. The fume chamber is a place where activities which involve harmful and volatile substances are carried out. During experiments, air is sucked into the chamber, which then rises with the vapour and harmful gases, which exit through the exhaust fan. The biological safety cabinet is a closed space used to protect the user and the surroundings from harmful pathogens. For example, HEPA filter is installed in a biological safety cabinet to eliminate harmful agents such as viruses and bacteria in the air that flow through it. Disposal of a waste material is divided into two types the substance that can be disposed in the sink and the substance that cannot be disposed in the sink. Substances that can be disposed in the sink are substances with pH value between 5 and 9 and liquid or solution of low concentration. Substances that cannot be disposed in the sink are substances with pH value less than 5 or more than 9 organic and solid waste specific chemical substances such as grease and oil reactive substances such as sodium and potassium organic solvents such as turpentine and acetone Toxic substances such as mercury and arsenic. Volatile substances such as liquid bromine and iodine. Heavy metals such as lead powder. And radioactive substances such as phosphorus 32. Biological waste can be classified into two types, namely biohazardous waste and non-biohazardous waste. Biohazardous waste are tissues of living things, apparatus or substances which contain viruses, bacteria and toxic substances. They are decontaminated in the autoclave machine and then disposed into the incinerators. Non-biohazardous waste are tissues of living things which do not contain any viruses, bacteria and toxic substances. They are safe to be disposed at the disposal sites. Generally, biohazardous waste are separated into four types of categories. For example, type A, which often refers to a sharp waste. For instance, shrinks, needles, glass slides, and glass pipettes. All these materials need to be properly managed. So, place them into sharp waste bins before disposal. Type B refers to non-sharp waste such as used cotton wools and gloves. They should be placed 
into biohazard plastic bags before disposal. Type C refers to organs and tissues of organisms. For example, animal carcasses, plant tissues, and biological specimens. They should be wrapped in tissue paper. Then, place them into biohazard plastic bags before disposal. Type D refers to fluid waste, such as blood, saliva, and serum. They should be decontaminated in the autoclave machines before disposal.